Leaders from five of the world's leading emerging markets say they are united when it comes to trade. They say protectionism, which is being pushed by US President Donald Trump, should be rejected. What is constant is the flare-up of geopolitical conflicts and the escalation of protectionism and unilateralism. They directly affect emerging markets and developing countries. We must work together with the United Nations, the G20 and the World Trade Organization to safeguard the rules-based multilateral trading system, liberalize and facilitate trade and investment, and reject protectionism outright. It's the first time presidents from the BRICS trade bloc are meeting since Donald Trump threatened to impose tariffs on all Chinese imports. Economists say the trade war could also hurt smaller countries. Some fear Trump's plans will stifle global economic growth. Leaders at the BRICS summit say increasing global trade encourages economies of all countries to grow. But emerging economies could be damaged if the U.S. imposes tariffs on certain goods. Trump's threats to impose tariffs have given Brazil, Russia, India, China and South Africa more reason to increase trade cooperation between them. It's also forced China, the world's second largest economy after the United States, to look for other markets to buy and sell its products. China has been the most important trading partner uh, with the U.S., uh, so was U.S. to China. Um, but now with this escalating trade tension, we can almost be certain that uh, in the next few years, the trade between those two countries will be hurt a lot, uh, along with a very volatile uh, exchange rate market, exchange market. So um, for China to extend uh, or to strengthen other relations, uh, Europe and Africa would be its top choices uh, because of the sheer, sh sheer size of those markets. BRICS leaders in South Africa have suggested another meeting be held where world players discuss their differences and perhaps prevent a global trade war. For that to happen, all parties have to agree to come to the table and try to find a balance between promoting national interests and those of the global community. Harumatasa Al Jazeera, Johannesburg.